Hi guys, as promised, it's now Wednesday morning. I've got a new holder this time because I used my clear advanced purple one. Uh, I actually, oh my God, this is so tight. I've got the stick out. They come like that, they're really sealed, like they're so difficult to get into. But anyhow, as you guys know, I use the holders twice over because you can use them repeated times, the battery holders, but don't share them. But where I've used it now for three cycles and I've got this one sat there from a new pack, I'm going to use a new one because I feel that other one, remember when I took 20 days to ovulate, it was used for quite a numerous amount of days. So I'm just starting with a new holder that's just come out. You have to match the arrows up, arrow to arrow, and here's a click. There you go. And that's what happens. It starts flashing like that, which is completely normal because that says it's, you're starting to test. And as soon as you get that, you dip. And it's 15 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifty. And a little twelve for you, Amber. So that, if all goes well, should start flashing. I'll show you in a minute. And as we all know, if you watch Simply Tanika, hi Tanika, it takes ages to flash. She was stood there for ages before it started flashing. Now, one day I did do that and it did, oh, there you go, it's flashing. So that means it's thinking. So I'll put that over there. And as I said, it's first morning urine, but Tanika did it and it seemed like it was flash, uh, still for ages or flashing for ages. That's just a cheapy ovulation strip from the pound shop. I'm gonna do one of those. One, two, three, four, five, and a little 12. They don't need very long, but I'm not expecting anything really on the OPK, the cheapy one, maybe a faint line, I don't know. I don't know what I'm expecting, but those you get like five for a pound, and I'm keeping those just so I can sellotape them to my diary sheet. That, as I say, I bought five refills on eBay for 8 99 I had the holder already with a few left over, so I have got a nice stack of those now. I don't want to use them all. I'd much rather fall pregnant and give them away to some lucky person and I've also got another sealed holder because when I bought them on eBay I got five and a sealed holder from this lady for a tenner so that was really good and then I got a refill set for 8 99 so do search eBay if you've got these because like that lady originally told me go on eBay and you can definitely get the refills you can get five for 8 99 but sometimes people stop trying they don't need them anymore and they sell half good packs which that's what I've done so I've spent like a total of 19 pounds but I've got like 12 sticks and a brand new holder and that holder that I already had so I'm all set for OPK testing today is day eight and I'm testing on day eight because I'm a 28 stroke 29 day cycle and that is what they recommend that OPK I'm expecting just to give me a circle which is a baseline which is absolutely normal your first day of testing it just gets the baseline of all your hormones inside and remember when you do get that flashy face on these they're testing for estrogen which is the lining getting made and then when it goes static, that's your LH third, which is the hormone that spikes the egg to be released. So it is a long-winded one with the purple. It's not a clear yes or no. So with a clear yes or no, you're just ready to go. So that probably will take a good three or four minutes. Chuck them on my bed so that when my husband comes up for a shower, he knows not to interrupt because I'm testing. It's still thinking that this does take quite a while sometimes. The girls that I've mentioned, they use, Amber uses a pink one that's a yes or no now, but Tanika uses these and they're brilliant because you get a four day window to sort of get baby dancing and it is good for me because we don't always want to be doing it every minute, every day. Um, it's a little bit better for me, to be honest. I feel a bit more in control now that I've got four days, but a lot of you prefer the pink yes or no's cut and dry, am I ovulating, am I not? But as I say, this gives you four most fertile days. So I'm expecting just a circle today. And that's what I'll probably, well, that's what I'll definitely get today because it's just getting my baseline. And every baseline in us is completely and utterly different because sometimes you might have in your body stronger estrogen one month to the next month. 
and I am taking Pregnacare, but what I did this time is mix it up a bit. I went to the chemist yesterday and I bought Pregnacare for conception, which is a different, slightly different colour box. You can take it in the early stages of pregnancy as well if you've still threw half a packet, but it just gives you an added boost of vitamin D and a bit of ginseng and things. So I've bought two boxes of normal, but I've mixed it up with um, a bottle of the a box of the conception because you get three for two in Boots which is a chemist in the UK. So the conception one I'm taking now with my either my breakfast or my lunch, and that hopefully with the extra boost of vitamin D, which is really good for the egg, um, may be a little bit of a head start for me for conception. And I did double check and the pharmacist said to me, you can definitely carry on taking that if you've like, got 10 tablets left or something. So that's what I'm doing this month that's different. So still just a prenatal and only the Pregnacare, but you can get standard Pregnacare, which you can take through pregnancy and breastfeeding, which I always take, or the conception one, or you can get for his and her, but we're just doing the conception box. So whether that would be different, I don't know. That is still flashing, it takes flipping ages. I've just got out of the shower. We're just about to get ready for holiday club for the kids. Three of them are off to football club and the other two little girls, we're gonna go on a bit of lunch and a bit of shopping today to cheer ourselves up. That's still going. That will be a circle anyway, that's all I'm saying. That will just read my baseline. So tomorrow I will do a live OPK and that will be a flashy face, hopefully. Or, I don't know, will it be day nine and a static? Had no idea, that's what it was last time. If it goes static on day nine, that's gonna make me a little bit, there you go, there's my baseline. So I'm all ready to go for tomorrow, so I'll be back tomorrow and we'll discuss more on OPKs then. Thanks for watching. Please remember to subscribe and like the video and have a lovely day. Thank you guys, bye.